Um, we'll head over to our Seattle Seawolves here, who, as we mentioned, have a tight playoff race in the Western Conference. Every game really counts. I think you can only lose maybe one game the rest of the season. And luckily, they didn't mm. burn that one game here. Uh, April 23rd at the Utah Warriors down in Utah, a 20-14 to 14 win. No bonus uh, points, unfortunately, in the standings. Player of the game, uh, number eight, Reichert Hatting, with two tries in the 37th and 63rd minute, was able to record those two tries despite recording a yellow card really early on in the match. Mm -hmm. So he was able to not have to worry about that. and Well, maybe he worried about it, but he was able to play through <laughs> yeah. it despite. And, I mean, your team captain kind of showing that, hey, I, I may have this, but I'm still going to be able to produce is pretty impressive. But, I mean, this was a game that was a little bit frustrating. I know that for a decent period of time, Seattle was losing 13 to 14. You're like, hey, Utah's only won two games. If you want to be in the playoff race, you lose this game, you're basically out. And they didn't do that, unfortunately. Well, fortunately. Um, but just looking at the scenarios and everything, every game really is important. And it doesn't get any, uh, like I said, you probably have to win f four out of five games um, if you want to secure one of those playoff spots. Because if we look at the, um, <clears throat> we look at Major League Rugby and their standings right now, we go Major League Rugby and we head over here. You know, I think Austin at first in the Western Conference has pretty much secured their place for yeah. first. Like, unless goodness, and that's who we face next. <laughs> yeah, unless something oh, meteoric happens, they're not moving out of first place with 43 points. LA sits at 33 in second. Seattle is third with 31. So two points separate you in second. On um, three teams from each conference make the playoffs. So right now you're in a spot. But fourth place has 31 points. That's Houston. San Diego is fifth place, and they have 28, and they're not that far out of it. Oh. Dallas and Utah don't care. Um, so That's uncomfortably close. Yeah, it's a really tight race, and like you mentioned, so now sitting at a 6-5 and five record, third in the Western Conference <clears throat> with those 30, uh, those points. Looking ahead, May 1st at Austin on the road against Austin. You already lost your first contest against Austin. So this is a 4 o'clock start time. This is... Yeah, this is a really big game. If you're able to win this, I'd say I'd have some confidence in you going forward to lock up maybe the second, potentially the third. But it's not going to get any easier because, again, I think you, I mentioned that you played Austin. You play L.A., who's second right now. Mm -hmm. You play Houston, who's right below you. And you play Rugby New York, who is a playoff team in the East. So there's four playoff teams potentially right there. All Everybody, four teams like fighting for their spot. Austin not fighting for their spot, but holding a commanding lead. So, and we have losses to Austin and LA already previously, right in the season. So maybe it'll be like revenge games. <laughs> Want to come out and win the next one? Well, yeah, but you. Ha I mean, there's there's so much added pressure too because yeah, you have to for sure. You know, and it's yeah, playoff spot. So that'll be a big deal.